in today's tutorial, I want to explain to you some new ways which ImageLine has put for you to create an account with the ImageLine. So I've gone to ImageLine website, which the link I'll put on the description below. So the way it is now, if you want to create an account with ImageLine, it's different the way it used to be some years back where you can just go to ImageLine.com, then find an option for you to create an account. It's no longer there. I'll explain later on why it is no longer there. So if you read here on top, it says, how do I get an image line account? Then here at the bottom here, starting from here, it says if you own an image line product, your account is used to unlock products from trial slash demo mode. It will also give you access to our support forums and allow you to receive image line newsletters. There are three ways you can create an image line account. You hear that? So number one, the first one is written here on top, which is online purchases from our website web shop slash in app shop so this one which says online purchases is when you buy fl studio from image line that is it online purchases then here at the bottom it says if you purchased a product online from our shop slash in app shop you must create an account during the purchase process you hear that we email you login details use the email address and password chosen to log in here if you have lost or forgotten this information recover it by following the steps here so let me explain here so that you understand what it means here so the way it is when you go to imageline.com then you choose the fl studio which you want to purchase so in the process of you purchasing fl studio they are going to email you the details which you can use for you to create an account because when you're purchasing FL Studio, they're going to give you an option where you're going to enter your email address. From that email address you're going to enter, they are going to send you details which you can create now image line account. That's what it means here. Then the second one it says box or other unlock code registration. Understand what is written here. Let me read. If you purchased products in a physical box or from an electronic retail that provide a serial code, this will be a 20 digit number with four groups of five letters and numbers in the format as you can see here if you don't already have an account you can register your serial number here the registration process will set up an account for you you hear that again so here again it is giving you an option when you purchase fl studio during the registration of that serial number which is found in that box which you have purchased fl studio that's when it's going to set up an account for you so you see even here it is talking about when you have purchased fl studio that's when you've got access for you to open an account then the third one is this one here which is then when submitting support ticket so here it says this sales supporting ticket system is only for pre-sales and the registration related issues. If you are a customer and you have a technical question, please post in one of our technical support forums. You have seen now. So some years back, ImageLine had an option of you creating an account even if you haven't purchased FL Studio. But they have removed that option. The reason why they have removed that option, it's written here. Do you want to create an account to gain access to the forum to ask questions? Then here it says, we restrict access to customers only because we have over 40,000 people every day installing the FL Studio trial. The number of trial users asking questions and looking for technical support would instantly overwhelm our capacity to help paying customers. You can find the answers most technical slash support questions yourself by searching our knowledge base or reading the FL Studio manual. So some of you ask these same questions. Always remember that you need to buy FL Studio for you to open ImageLine account.